Hello and welcome to Cloud Infrastructure Services YouTube channel. So in this video, we are going to show you how you can set up the reverse proxy server using Nginx on Ubuntu hosted on AWS. So from the link in the description box, come to this marketplace listing. From here, you want to click on continue to subscribe. Basically, you want to create a new EC2 virtual machine. And then from this page, you want to click on accept terms. After the subscription has validated, simply click on continue to configuration. And then simply choose the AMI which is the Amazon machine image, choose the software version and choose the region that is closest to you. After that click on continue to launch. And then basically you can launch the EC2 instance using the website or you can use the EC2 management console. So I am going to go with launch through EC2 and then click on launch. From this page you can customize your virtual machine. So give it a name, I am going to call it Nginx reverse. Make sure that the image selected is the one that you got from the link in the description box which is the Nginx Ubuntu 20.04. Choose the instance type. Choose the key pair. So I'm going to choose an already existing key pair. Then scroll down and make sure that the configuration is according to your needs. And when you're satisfied, simply click on launch instance. After that, you can head over to EC2 management console by clicking on view all instances. From here, you can see our newly created virtual machine which is in pending state. So wait for a little while for it to convert to running state. So now when it has changed its state to running, simply right click on it and then click on connect. So now we are going to create an SSH terminal to connect to our virtual machine. So for that, copy this command, either open up a new command prompt or a PowerShell, paste the command and replace the quotation marks for the path where you have downloaded your private key. After that is done, simply hit enter and when prompted, type in yes and hit enter. And now as you can see that I am able to access my virtual machine using the SSH terminal. So now I can now finally move on to configuring my Nginx reverse proxy. So the very first thing that I need to do is that I need to head inside the directory of the Nginx which is cd forward slash etc forward slash Nginx. And in here I am going to ls command to show all the directories and I am going to head inside the configuration.d directory. And I'm going to type in the ls command once more to see all the configuration files. And as you can see that we did not have any configuration file. So I'm going to create a new one by using the command sudo nano. And then I'm going to name my file as amazon.config. So basically what I want is that when the clients visit my IP address, I want to forward that request to Amazon while maintaining my own URL. So within this file, I want to type in the following commands. So I'm going to start off with the keyword server, then a pair of curly brackets. And then I'm going to type in the keyword listen and the port number is 80. Then I'm going to type in listen, use a pair of square brackets and within those square brackets I'm going to use in two columns. And after the square brackets I'm going to use another colon and type in the port number which is 80. And then I'm going to use the keyword server underscore name. This would define our server. And then in here I'm going to pass in the IP address for my virtual machine. So I'm going to go back to my EC2 management console. I'm going to hit back and from here I am going to select my virtual machine and I am going to copy my public IPv4 address. Head back to my command prompt and paste my address after the server name and finish this line off with a semicolon. Now basically this was our main server and now we are going to put in a reverse proxy. For that I am going to use the keyword location then forward slash then a pair of curly brackets and within those curly brackets I am going to type in proxy underscore pass and then the link where I want to redirect my clients to. So I'm going to paste in the link for Amazon. And then at the very end, I'm going to place in a semicolon. Now I want to save this file and exit by using the keys Ctrl plus O and Ctrl plus X. And lastly, I want to use the command sudo space engine X space hyphen S and reload and hit enter. And now basically you're done with setting up your reverse proxy. So if I head back to my browser, copy my public IP address, paste it inside a new tab and hit enter. You can see that I would be redirected towards Amazon while maintaining my URL. So basically I was successful in setting up my reverse proxy. So if you have any queries regarding this tutorial, make sure to leave them in the comment section. And also make sure to check out the links in the description box for this particular image in the Amazon marketplace. And also for the blog post that contains the step-by-step -step guide on how to set up Nginx server on AWS, Azure and GCP. And if this video has helped you in any way, make sure to leave a like and subscribe.